The devastating floods have wreaked havoc in Nepal, India and Bangladesh along with China. Till now, 38 people are reported missing in Nepal following landslides and floods over the past three days. At least 120 people have been killed and tens of thousands are affected by floods and landslides triggered by monsoon rains across Nepal. At least 26,000 emergency workers, including police officers and soldiers, were deployed in the flooded areas across Nepal. And torrential rains battered the low-lying region bordering India for three days in early August. The overall flood situation in Bihar continued to be grim, with major rivers in the state reaching banks, inundating new areas and displacing thousands of people. The flood situation has also worsened in east and west Champaran in the last 24 hours in the Gandak River, which was breaching the embankment in Baga. The state's disaster management department has confirmed that flood and death, uh, the death toll due to flood has risen to 56 authorities fear the death toll might increase further. The government has launched massive relief uh, and rescue operations with help from the Army, Air Force as well as the National Disaster Response Force and Bihar State Disaster Response Teams have also come in. Meanwhile, floods in North Bangladesh have killed at least 39 people in the last few days and affected more than 5 lakh. Officials are delivering emergency supplies and building emergency shelters on war footing and searching people at the same time. In the Gaibanda in northern Bangladesh, soldiers were seen reinforcing houses with sandbags. In China, heavy rains have hit the capital, Beijing, on Wednesday and uh, with four weather alerts issued in just two hours, According to the Met Department, a thunderstorm may hit Beijing with short-term hailstorm. Meanwhile, continuous rainfall in China has won Nan province since last Friday had left three dead and one missing. <coughs>